Hey, it's Alfonso Rivera. What up, Long Beach? Welcome back to your home for everything local sports. It's JJ. And Mike. And Tyler. And this Grand Prix video is brought to you by Naples Rib Company. Perfect place to cater your next event. They're racing for charity on Saturday in the streets of Long Beach, the 2015 Pro Celebrity Race. The 39th running of this race benefiting Racing for Kids once again, which benefits the Orange County and Long Beach Miller Children's Hospitals. Plenty of familiar faces. Robert Patrick, Mackay Pfeiffer. Yeah, a lot of uh, memorable names and knowable faces out here in Long Beach. Willie Galt, uh, Super Bowl champion with the Chicago Bears, wide receiver out here. Some will look better than others behind the wheel here in the LBC. And some will have you sing 1990s hits. Oh, put your halo on the head post. Uh, we do have a multiple champion in Alfonso Ribeiro and, of course, Rutledge Wood, who won here a couple years ago and remains. He won re-election. He's still the mayor of the pro celebrities. Oh, everybody loves Rutledge Wood, and we've got to take you to the That's So Hollywood moment of the weekend. I mean, Robert Patrick first forgets to take off his sunglasses, and then he's not talking to his assistant there. He's just pumping himself up for the race. And as Mackay Pfeiffer tries to get ready, lost my gloves, lost my gloves. Old glory coming down from above as it does every year. I love this tradition. I would just never volunteer for it. No, uh, that's a little further than I would want to fall. And speaking of soaring like an equal, soaring like a Washington Redskin, I guess, Deshaun Jackson, the Long Beach legend, back in town to be the Grand Marshal and uh, get their engines going today, JJ. Yeah, he gave it a little twist. I like it. He said, everybody, let's get our engines going. Let go. Well, you have to put your twist on it, and D-Jack definitely bringing the east side out here t downtown and to put a little flavor on it as we got this thing going. Great sights and sounds. Turn one uh, coming towards the Dolphin Fountain right in front of the aquarium. I mean, just drink in the beautiful shots of Long Beach. Uh, you can't not get a beautiful shot of this track. The whole thing is just so picturesque. Kind of a parade here before they get the green flag. Josh Morrow from Nickelodeon, Raul Mendez, and Novella actor are the top celebrity qualifiers. Ribeiro is the top pro. But once the race starts, we get back to turn one, a real crash monument. Uh, yes, absolutely. Willie Galt running the skinny post and gets blindsided by the safety. Didn't tap the brake, so he backs into traffic. Yeah, pro Anton Brown clips him, and I believe that's a 15-yard penalty. Well, and uh, Willie spent time with the Raiders, so he knows things about 15-yard penalties. Uh, unfortunately, unlike his time at the University of Tennessee, he would not make it to the checkerboard today. Dave Paysant, the auction winner again, and Morrow are up there, but here comes the Ribeiro Express. He ran through the entire field doing the Carlton past everybody, snaps and all, passes Morrow on the fourth lap to complete the back of the field to front of the field run, just record fast. And uh, as he <laughs> managed to get Morrow on turn nine, and then look at how fast he is. He's so far ahead, he turned a 16 second trail to a 16 second win in 10 laps. Yeah, it turned into a chase back behind Ribeiro. Like you said, that 16 second win to take the checkered flag 19 years after he raced in this race. Now the real action is down the stretch between Morrow and Paysant for the second place. Last lap into the hairpin here. We go to the replay and Paysant with a move straight out of cops. Yeah, it's a perfect hit maneuver. These two fighting for the celebrity championship. Morrow had led the entire race. He was the top qualifier and pole sitter, but pays on. The expert move spins him and moves around. He actually said that was not a, it was an accident. He did not want to spin him, and he wished he could do it again, but it's Ribeiro and Paysant, the two champions. They're going to pop some champagne, enjoy the victory, and continue entertaining us in the press conference. And it took 19 years to get him back in the race, 20 years to be a champion once again out here in Long Beach. He dominated this race, Mr. Alfonso Rivera. Well, it's crazy. Everybody tries to describe you what you're going to feel like when they uh, drop that green flag and how, how crazy it's going to get uh, at the start. And it was everything that everybody said. Step into my world for a second. <laughs> and the green flag goes, okay? There is an adrenaline rush. I was, I was, I thought I was going to be in sin mode the whole time, very focused. You know, young man may get killed type of thing. I mean, I just lose yourself in my head on repeat. Uh, you know, going back to what you said earlier, I certainly wanted to prove to my wife that if she does go into labor, I can get you to the hospital all the time <laughs> and safely. There's not a scratch on that car, baby. It'll, it'll be okay. But to be back here 20, you know, 19 years, 20 years since since my last victory here at Long Beach, and to be back in Toyota um, has been quite special, um, to say the least. Uh, and it started absolutely with Thursday, you know, going to the Miller Hospital. Uh, this is by far the best uh, set of folks 
from a chemistry standpoint, nobody's got giant egos. Everybody checked it at the door. Everybody was wonderful. We went to the Miller's Children's Hospital, and it was, it was wonderful. And that's really what this reason is about. So, to, 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 to win this thing is just, it's a, it's a dream come true for me, but in one way it was a dream that I never ever expected to, uh, would ever occur. I just love being in the race, I love being a participant, love what the foundation does, I love what the Grand Prix Association does, and, and uh, really respect everybody that, that puts this event on.